Manipur government has decided to set up a five-star hotel in the Naga River colony, which has led to a strong and vocal protest by its residents. A fact-finding team composed of national-level civil society organizations have expressed apprehension that the state is issuing colonial land and acquisition laws to oust the 500 Naga River villages. Huge security forces were deployed to access the property against the will of the people who live there. The colony continued to fight against this project in the hope that the law will be on their side and protect them from what seems to be just another greedy acquisition. My name is Achumai Kami and this is my community. We came to Infal to see for ourselves what was the situation. And I must tell you, I was aghast when I came face to face with reality. It was decided into dozens of village people going through every document I could get. It was quite clear the government has decided to demolish this village long before they started the formal proceedings to set up a hotel under a people's government partnership. Now this is ridiculous. You have not done a survey, you have no database to find out how much land you need. And long before that, you give notifications and threaten the people that the land will be taken away. Under Karmena, Karigumut development in the Magda, five star hotel, Sagani, so involved hotels, five hotels, five star hotel, and two can be high visit down. Five point six acre moina, Kalak Livina, Kalak Livina, Koji, Lekagi, I put the soap to Bayadaba, in Mangatara, soap to the day and to the Sanabini, Prezagini, Prezagini, Niang Bini, Kormini, a boy to Boyke. A dubo, Lamma, Lamma, Hongan by Hibisi, history among Mangan Bini, a dubo, Sangam Ike, Aduga, or men like the Sanga, a super Tabama Tokani Hibisi, Section One, the King of Seven Paula Pusna, a boy from Professor Pide, a single Ike, or men that's in a token, learning on Paula Pusna. I put information on the government The Supreme Court has held and the governments of many states have held that it is not good to make people internally displaced, that it is not good to take away the land for frivolous reasons such as setting up a hotel, which can be set up at any other place. So, after investigating, it is my appeal to the government to call these people for talks, to desist from taking hasty decisions, to be transparent in their transactions, so that people do not think that the whole exercise is to benefit a few rich people. Why must security forces be deployed for land and property assessment? Why weren't the people of Naga River Colony consulted by the government when it made this decision to build a five-star hotel on this land? The fact that I don't have answer to these questions makes me angry and helpless. So just imagine what the colony residents are going through. I'd like all future public-private partnerships to involve discussion with those who will be affected. A compromise must be reached with their complete agreement before any evictions takes place. I'm Achukumai Kame and I'm reporting for Naga Colony.